At least five teens have died on our Valley roads in just the past two weeks. 8 News Now reporter Joshua Piguero caught up with driving instructors working to keep teens safe by teaching them defensive driving skills at the Las Vegas Motor Speedway. This is a safe place where cars can screech and hydroplane without the consequences of a bad wreck or worse, losing a life. That appealed to Xander Luber, the Cena, and his father, Ralph. They did emphasize just the, the breathing and staying calm during the situation. I think uh, we need to get the word out to more people, have more of our young drivers take a, uh, participate. Jeff Payne, founder of Driver's Edge, would love to expand the program. He says he had around 800 kids on a waiting list for this weekend's sessions. Everyone thinks they're a good driver. No one, I think, takes it as seriously as they should because a vehicle is a weapon, you know, and we kill, you know, over 40,000 people a year in car crashes. Driver's Edge, now in its 22nd year, seems more important than before. Just on Saturday, two teens were killed in a four-car wreck on Pecos and Hacienda, making them the 36th and 37th traffic-related death in Metro's jurisdiction so far this year. And if you look at this scene, it's utter devastation. The vehicle is completely split in half. One of the things that organizers wanted to emphasize to these children is that when you're behind the wheel to be fully present and to eliminate any and all distractions, that means cell phones. So my job is to look and steer where I want the entire car to go. Here's an example of what one should do if a car skids. When the car's gonna slide, I'm looking and I'm steering, I'm looking and I'm steering, and then I straighten my wheel out. Reporting at the Las Vegas Speedway, Joshua Peguero, 8 News Now. Driver's Edge will return on April 5th. If you missed it this weekend, you can find a link to register on our website, 8newsnow.com.